And well, if you've been out on the roads and highways lately, you won't be surprised to hear that distracted driving is a very serious problem. So today a new law was created with the goal of keeping our roads safer. Daryl and Horn is here for you with more on the new law that takes effect later this month. That's right, Sherry. This new law aims to eliminate any use of a handheld phone while you drive. Today, Governor Whitmer joined families who have lost loved ones in car crashes caused by distracted driving so they could see the bill signed themselves. Today is a great day for the safety of all Michigan drivers. Change the law in the state of Michigan. Let's do it. And by that, Governor Whitmer means the creation of a new law, something she calls bipartisan efforts. These bills will ban the use of a phone while driving, including sending texts, watching or recording videos, or engaging with social media. The package of bills was inspired by the families at today's press conference. Loved ones like Mitchell Kiefer, the son of a retired General Motors executive. He was a freshman at Michigan State when he was killed by a distracted driver on I-96. Each traffic death is more than just a statistic. States that have enacted distracting driving laws, including Ohio, have seen accidents fall between 9 and 20 percent. So far this year, we have had 322 deaths on Michigan roads. Our goal is to get to zero traffic deaths by 2050. If you are caught holding your phone while driving, that'll cost you between $100 and $250 in 16 to 24 hours of community service. If it's three or more times within three years, the courts could require you to take a driving improvement course. They'll help us save lives, reduce crashes, and ensure no family has to go through the tragedy of losing a family member. Law enforcement, first responders, and other emergency workers will still be allowed to use a cell phone while they're on the clock. And anyone calling or texting 911 or other emergency services will also be exempt from the law that goes into effect on June 30th.